I'm Jennifer Angel. This is my horoscope overview for October the 6th. Okay, so today we've, we're still in that um, fairly disruptive uh, period of the transit with the Sun square Pluto, which is very powerful. Mercury is retrograde, and yesterday we had the uh, Mars trine. Um, Uranus, which you know can make you quite outspoken. Now today we've got the Moon square uh, Mars, which again can make you a little outspoken or a lot outspoken. And uh, but it is also trining the Moon is trining uh, Saturn, so this allows you to get in touch with your feelings more. So it's quite a good balance here if you can get in touch with them and then express them. But you want to be um, mindful, as I said yesterday, you want to be in control. And we all want to be in control if we can. And it's much better if we, first of all, if we recognize how we feel, take responsibility for those feelings, and then can express them in, you know, a more a more control, but feeling from the heart way. Wow, it sounds easy when you say it, doesn't it? So not so, not so much, but we're leading up to a, a, a full lunar eclipse. So um, keep this in mind. So the first couple of weeks here of um, October are really like there's lots of triggers and the triggers can be confronting yes but they can also just help you get in touch with with you and really that's the key to everything if you're going to first of all get in touch with how you feel and uh, then you can uh, you know start to tell other people how you feel and start an interaction rather than putting your stuff on someone else and you know saying well you did this or putting the blame on someone else first of all bring it back bring it back to yourself and if you can do that and just have a and it's a learning process you can take us a lifetime and beyond to <laughs> learn how to get to know ourselves okay so don't give yourself too much of a hard time if you feel like you're taking you know one step or two steps forward and one back um, you know that's okay and uh, it's all life is full of compromises and um, you want to always try to look for the silver lining and find things in your life you can be grateful for and when you know when you feel out of balance and uh, anyway when I do when I feel out of balance then that's what I do to help bring myself back into balance and meditation of course but we all have different ways that we meditate you know you don't have to sort of sit there and be a guru and you know, um, to meditate I mean just having some quiet time alone is meditative so you find out what works for you and try and incorporate that into your life and that'll help you over this time and any other challenging time in your life okay love and luck to you I'm Jennifer Angel thanks for watching